than a week away from Election Day, and Atlanta's mayoral race continues to heat up. Former mayor and now candidate Kasim Reed is calling out City Council President Felicia Moore for what he sees as a controversial endorsement, and Moore is now firing back. CBS 46's Ashley Thompson is live in Atlanta to break this one down for us. Ashley? And Tracy, this endorsement came from a man named Lee Clevenger, and it was posted to Felicia Moore's Instagram account, but has since been deleted, and she is now distancing herself from this man. For more than 40 years now. One particular endorsement of Felicia Moore has Kasim Reed up in arms. We have never had a mayor that has a conscience and cares about the people and is not interested in anything except finding their own pockets. Lee Clevenger stood next to Felicia Moore and in front of her said that every mayor who happens to be black was corrupt. Reed's campaign displayed social media posts by a man named Lee Clevenger, a man they say has been friends with Moore for years. Addressing notable mayors of the past, one comment reads, I don't agree that Jackson and Franklin were great leaders. I think they were both quite corrupt. Another post depicts President Barack Obama and then Vice President Joe Biden with a quote that reads, we could run away to Kenya. I hear you have family there. How could you stand beside him as he ridiculed people that have created the path of opportunity that you now walk down. Less than one week before the election, Kasim Reed calling for Felicia Moore to reject the endorsement and return any campaign contributions made by Clevenger. And she is. Moore's campaign sent CBS 46 a statement which reads, quote, Mr. Clevenger has been a longtime constituent and I've known him only in my capacity as a city council representative. I was simply unaware of the hateful and racist things he had been posting on social media and I strongly disagree with them. I've instructed my team to return his contributions. Other mayoral candidates also weighing in. Andre Dickens sent CBS 46 a statement which reads, quote, all of these things are a distraction from what the voters care about. Safe streets, affordable housing, good jobs. We are deep in a fight for the soul of Atlanta. I'm focused on sharing my vision for Atlanta, not on these other distractions. And candidate Antonio Brown said he had no comment. We did reach out to candidate Sharon Gay. We are still waiting to hear back. Of course, those are all the front runners of this mayoral race. We did, uh, excuse me, uh, Felicia Moore did want us to read the rest of the statement that she sent to CBS 46. And that reads, quote, if Mr. Reed wants to play guilt by association, I'd remind Atlanta voters that seven of his top staff and personal appointees have faced federal criminal charges for their actions while he was mayor, including for bribery and illegal weapons charges. Certainly this race is heating up ahead of Election Day. For now, I'm live in Atlanta, Ashley Thompson, CBS 46 News. And we knew it would heat up. Ashley